this was an experience true to all actors. So many of us had uh, had cons that we were going to go to and, and get to have those interactions and we were all canceled. Um, and we'd all been receiving tweets and uh, messages on Instagram about how disappointed people were. And so Paul had been doing this uh, to try and fill that gap. And I had done a live with a co-star of mine, Adelaide Kane, and we sort of said, oh, it's too bad you can't have more than one people on a live because we were going to a rain con that was canceled. Uh, and, you know, people were really disappointed. So Paul came to me and he said, you know, we should do a virtual Comic-Con. And it was it was just sort of the convergence of perfect timing. And I, I, I really genuinely felt it was a genius idea. So I, I said that to him. And that was all Paul needed. He was set on fire <laughs> from that point. So, um, so you know, we we started what is is HomeCon, and and honestly, it has exceeded our even our wildest expectations. We have a, such an amazing team who's put together something really, really in eleven days. This was just 11 an idea days. eleven yeah. days ago, yeah. and you know, we have this crack squad of people that it, it is evolving and growing. Um, because that's the nature of doing something like this. This is a first. It's never been done before. And, um, you know, it takes a lot of effort and it's a lot of technical know-how. So we have people from L.A., Washington, uh, Ottawa, all, like, all around trying to make this virtually happen. Um, and it's, uh, it's, it's not an easy thing to do. Um, and it's, we're running her about 16, 18 hours a day right now just to try and get this done. But yeah, 11 days ago, this was just a dream. That's amazing because uh, the smile on your face, Paul, when, when she said it was such a great idea, I, I love that it can come together so quickly these days. Like, it, it yeah, I mean, listen, duty. trust me, if, if, if Scarston's saying that something that I say is a genius idea, I act on it quickly. <laughs> <laughs> because usually it's like, no, no, Paul, you're going to get arrested. Don't do that. That's a bad idea. <laughs> so how many people have you got participating in terms of like talent and actors and so on? Um, what's, what's our queue looking like right now? Uh, I think right now it's 36, possibly 37 wow. actors. Yeah. yeah. And, and we honestly have had so many actors since we launched and actually <laughs> crashed the site because there was so much traffic. We've had so many people reaching out to us that we, we don't even know saying, hey, this is so great, you know, what you're doing. I want to be a part of it. So we've had to sort of make a bit of a cue for a possible, you know, HomeCon 2.0 because uh, people people are just really excited about it, you know. They, they not only want to give back to the community that they've been a part of, which is all the, the fans and the Comic-Cons, but also, they want to give back uh, in a meaningful way to the frontline workers and mm. you know the people who are who are keeping us all all safe and and really doing what is actually the hard work right now. Yeah, and one of the big things for you know Rachel and myself is you know when we were talking about this is that we really wanted to make something accessible for people. We know what people are going through right now. I mean, us. I mean, we're out of a job. Um, but you know, some people are really out of a job and it's, it, it's a difficult time. So we wanted to make this highly accessible to everybody and we wanted to give everybody an experience for $5 and some people can have a unique experience for $55. Um, unless you choose to do two chats and then it's 105. But I mean, that is like an incredible weekend of 15 shows. So if you imagine Twitch, which is the streaming channel that we're going to use for this is like our comic con. So you pay four 99, but if you have Amazon prime, you get a free sub so you can watch it for free. You come through the doors of our comic con and there you'll be able to watch for two days, 15 panels from 15 different shows. And um, there'll be little bits of entertainment in between. And then if you imagine a normal convention is like Even if you did this fall, I'm like, how I can't believe we're pulling this off, you and me. I know. It's insane. <laughs> it's insane. And then if you imagine the signing tables in the traditional sense of a, a right. comic con is our one-to-one -one Zoom chats, which will be five minutes for fifty dollars and nobody can buy more than two in terms of the length of time. Um, and that 
is our Comic Con. And it's all going to happen on Twitch. It's all going to happen Friday and Saturday. Um, and we're really, really excited. And so are the talent. Because when we told them that we wanted to make something accessible for everybody, um, that's what really was, uh, was, a, was a real huge selling point to get so many people involved. And that's why a lot of uh, the talent are calling us. They just want to give back to all these people, create a community um, that they can get connected into so that nobody in this crisis is alone. Yes. Right. And that's, I mean, I think that's the biggest thing right now too, is that for the fans, there's nothing else like this. The, I mean, a lot of them have gone through probably most of their streaming services, all the things they want to watch. <laughs> so true. this is an amazing opportunity to be like, hey, this is like a whole weekend of entertainment. Yeah, exactly. And it's going to be fun entertainment too. We've encouraged all of the actors and everybody involved in this project, even the core team of people that we work with. I mean, we have a lot of fun every day. We're working 16, 17, 18 hour days, but we're having a lot of fun with each other. And we really want the actors and the fans to have that fun too. On yeah. the panel. So everyone, bring your pets to this Comic Con or to this fan event. Bring, <laughs> you know, bring, uh, you can come show up in your pajamas. Yeah, I'm sure a bunch of actors are going to do a bunch of, uh, you know, there's 35 actors. What could go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's some cosplay. I hope we're going to see some actors cosplaying. Well, That's my hope. <laughs> We yeah. also want want people, you know, from their homes to to make cosplay. Uh, put it up on their Instagram, tag us, tweet us. We'll retweet you. Put it up on. And our we'll YouTube. try and get some of those cosplay videos. Like if if people want to do like a thirty second uh, cosplay to music, and they send it to us, we do actually have the capacity of maybe streaming a few of those over the weekend. That's cool. So that people will be able to like get themselves in their cosplays presented to the world, which is, you know, what we're going to do with this. This, this isn't like geographic, this isn't geospecific, this is global. So we want to like get everybody from around the world in this community and really close that circle, which is a first and it's really exciting and it's going to be really unique. I think it's going to be really unique. And the thing I love too, is that it comes from the lost girl, you know, alumni here. Uh, it's amazing to me to still see how much Lost Girl means to so many people. Are you expecting quite a contingent of Lost Girl fans coming out too? I have to ask. Yeah, I would imagine. And we've also got, you know, Winona Earp. Um, and I know there's, a lot, of, there's a lot of cross-pollination between yeah, us. We're announcing another actor uh, from Winona Earp, a fan fave. So we're oh, really, really excited today. We're announcing her today. Yeah, we have we have some big uh, we have some big things happening with uh, some drops of some talent today as well. So some some people we haven't announced yet, which is really exciting. And uh, who knows, maybe one or two more as the days go roll by. Although it's Friday, right? This con, <laughs> <I'm> convention. <laughs> You've got a little time left. Yeah, not a genius yeah. idea, Paul. Not a genius idea. <laughs> not that no, one. No, 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 no. So, you know, in terms of you guys, how are you getting through otherwise? What are you doing during the quarantine and self-isolation? This. This yeah, is this. taking up. I mean, I even dream about HomeCon now. It is, wow. it is a full-on thing. Uh, as Paul said, we've been doing it sort of 18 hours a day. Um, just yeah, we're living, so we're living, living yeah. and dreaming and working on con right now. Our partners are also working on it, both of them. You know, we've had to enlist so much help to try and make this possible. Um, you know, I just want to ever, also everybody to know, we, you know, the 10% that we're giving to charity off the top of this. And then the actors are allowed to then donate to their own specific charities. But, you know, the rest of this is a lot of people working a lot of hours and the incredibly talented people working incredible hours for zero at the moment to get this up and running. This is something that we are doing for the fans. Like, and we have put, a, like, by the time we get to this, about two weeks of constant everyday work to bring you something fun. That's um, amazing. So, you know, that, that's a really important part of the story. So can you imagine then that in 
I know the time's almost up here, but can you imagine, uh, you know, down the road that you're going to do a few more of these? Because we, we're probably going to be stuck like this at least until June. Yeah, so yeah. We, uh, we did a little Easter egg on our Instagram. If you go check, there is a O1 uh, in homage to uh, the book. So we are absolutely planning on doing a 2.0 if people like this one. Uh, we have already quite a wonderful list of actors uh, who would like to participate in 2.0. Um, you know, so we just say to people, go subscribe watch the fan event, let us know what you think. And if everyone likes it, we would absolutely love to do it again. Yeah. Take it a little further. I can almost imagine you guys doing some, I don't know, skits, other things. I mean, you could record almost oh, anything. I'm dying to do skits on, on Twitch. Are you kidding? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, uh, you know, if this 2.0 version, I think we can get up and running in about a month. So, you know, at the moment, what we're looking at for the second incarnation of this is probably about 30 days. Wow. And who knows, we might be doing this monthly as we do this, as it goes on. Um, because I think that's, why not? Let's bring entertainment. And if you had those two, two days to look forward to every month, at least it's going to help some people get through quarantine because <laughs> it's going to get pretty boring soon. <laughs> It's true because the next thing is going to be the shows are going to dry up, right? Because there's there's only so much content that was filmed before this. So you yeah. guys are going to have to fill that void. Oh, okay. yes. Pressure. <laughs> well, thank you guys very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you okay. so much. Thank you so much, too. Time, yeah. Truly. Of nice. course. And good luck. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I'm sure you'll be well. <laughs> <laughs> bye. Okay, bye.